In this short video, we will see how the Aviomania Booster Protator operates to see the benefits of this system and why somebody may choose to use this system and describe the, the way it works. Firstly, I would like to say that the purpose of designing this system it was to have a very light but very effective free rotation system. We are using this small brushless motor which is capable of delivering about two and a half horsepower to pre rotate the rotor blades. How this system works is completely different to and to all the other pre rotators that are available today. This small motor is capable of giving static rotor RPM between 120 to 150 rotor RPM depending on the rotor blades but these rotor RPM are not the only thing that this small rotator can do it is designed to be able to provide a positive boost on the rotor RPMs up to 280 rotor RPM so once you get your maximum static rotor RPM you increase your throttle at about one third and you start your ground run once the ground run starts the added air speed through the rotor system helps this motor to spin up the blades faster so you will see the rotor RPM rising as soon as you get 150-160 you can go to half throttle and very shortly after you will see the rotor RPM increasing to 190 RPM and by that time you can increase to full throttle and then very rapidly they will accelerate to flying speed most gyros take off at 220 or 250 rotor RPM and as soon as you take off you can release the engagement button which is situated on the control stick and you continue flying how it works we have these two switch buttons which are used to activate the pre rotator we have the speed controller unit which we can adjust this, uh, the speed of the motor and this is the manual speed controller we have just developed a semi-automatic speed controller which you don't need to adjust anything it adjusts everything by itself we are testing it when we have enough tests on it we will be able to supply it and the other thing you need is two 12 volt batteries we are using this cheap 12 volt 7 amp hours batteries which you found that they are very reliable very cheap and powerful enough you can get a 9 amp hour battery and you can buy them for 20-25 uh, euros or let's say 30-35 dollars so how the system works have these two buttons and the reason we have two buttons is so that you cannot accidentally start the pre rotator while flying so what you do you press the stick button and then the seven button which you can situate anywhere you it com is convenient for you press it and the system starts after three seconds is ready to operate and you accelerate when you take off you just release the stick button and you are off flying now the system although it's 24 volt has as we can see here a 12 volt output which you can connect to your instruments radio or anything you want to power with 12 volt it also has a charging input which is this one and this you get the output of your rectifier regulator you supply it to this plug and this will be charging batteries 
So these are all the parts you will get in the box and this is everything you need to connect everything. And this is how the system looks installed on the rotor head and top tube. Now, what about our claim that this is the light test rotator system? Well, let's prove it. Here is a digital scale and we will check the weights. This is the ring gear. This is a 1224 volt converter. This is the motor unit. The speed controller. And these are all the wires you will need to connect. We've even included the wires. We included more than enough wire to connect it just to be on the safe side. And these are all the plugs and nuts and bolts. So, total weight of the installed system is 3.7 or let's say 3.8 kilograms. What this in pounds? This is 8.3 pounds installed weight. If you already have a battery, which you will need to replace the single battery you have to the two smaller ones, which equals to almost the same weight. Now, a lot of people, when we say this is a very light system, they say yes, 8 pounds, but the batteries are very heavy. Well, if you need a very light uh, pre rotator system and you don't have a battery on your jar because you want to save on weight, you can use these batteries. If we add these batteries, total weight goes to 9.7 pounds this is the completed installed weight with very light batteries these two batteries they are a bit more expensive than the other ones they go at around 45 euros each let's say 55 60 dollars each and this is the cheap version of the batteries we have new batteries which are about $20, $25 more expensive and they can last for about 12 pre-rotations with a single charge. These simple batteries they can last up to 6-7 pre-rotations with a single charge. These batteries need one hour to be fully charged from a 12 volt source so you can connect it to your car battery just before flying and charge them. The newer ones, the, these more expensive which they are about $80 each, they can be charged in just 12 minutes, again from your car uh, battery. So you can charge them, use them, you have enough juice there for 12 uh, pre-rotations and then take them home and use them next time you will fly. So. This is just 9.7 pounds or 4.4 kilograms including the light batteries. So if you need a light pre-rotator, don't hesitate to contact us and we can give you more information. On our prototype pre-rotator, we had more than 300 uh, pre-rotations until now and there was no problem uh, whatsoever and still works fine. So if this is used correctly you can have a very light, very dependable and very useful pre-rotation system.